Meghan Markle. Prince Harry refused to go on radio show during appearance. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry made their first joint appearance of the new year as an engaged couple by stopping I represent 107.3 FM in Brixton. While the two were all smiles and happily held hands outside of the station, once indoors, the couple put their foot down when it came to speaking on live radio. Markle and Prince Harry were visiting the station to meet the staff and learn more about their programs, which aim to help young people by training them in broadcasting and radio. During their appearance, the serial and founder of the station, Shane Carey, revealed that the couple had no desire to go on the air. They were very clear they didn't want to be on the radio but one thing they were very, very strong on, which I quite liked actually, is that they wanted to talk to young people as much as possible, he told reporters. Prince Harry, who is reportedly passionate about helping the youth, was eager to learn more about the program. The reason they are coming is because we are aligned very closely to their interests. We do a lot of work around mental health, Kerry explained. The whole model of represent is peer mentoring, and I know that is something that really interests Prince Harry, he added. While Markle and Prince Harry's visit caused quite a frenzy around the station, Kerry insisted that business would continue as usual and the royal would have a better understanding of what is done in the studio. It's less about them and more about hearing the stories of those here. From Harry's point of view it's a fact-finding thing and he genuinely wants to see it in action. You can see these things on paper but that doesn't really convey what we do. While Markle and Prince Harry opted out of a chat on the radio, the couple was more than willing to speak with the crowd outside of the station. One fan told people that they were utterly surprised that Markle actually took the time to have a conversation with them. She said hello to everyone, a fan named Tracy revealed. I thought she'd just take the flowers and go, but she asked me my name, the excited individual gushed. Although Markle and Prince Harry may not be interested in talking on the radio, it looks like fans of the couple will have better luck speaking with the two ahead of the royal wedding set to take place this spring.